Hey folks, welcome back to Galsiv 4. In the last episode, we commenced our attack on the Yore, and we're going to see what's the consequences of this now. Okay, first subspace stream flight. With a flashing trick of physics, the ship is gone, having travelled farther and faster than any of our kind has travelled before. Today, the galaxy has gotten much, much smaller. Yeah, there we go, look. Okay, so that must have been one of our... I think it was... Which ship that would have that been? There we are, look. It's this freighter, look. So uh, we sent a freighter down over to Drangi, um, try and get some trade going with the, with the Drangin. I don't think it's going to stop them from attacking us if they want to. Uh, notice how some of our neighbours now are openly hostile. Yeah, look, the Phalanoids, for example, you're at war with our friend. That's not good. Same with the Manti Cluster, you're at war with our friend. I don't know why any of these people would want to be friends with the Yor. I guess that the Yor have basically just been doing, you know, this whole... Help me, I'm under attack by evil culture thing. Okay, uh, we've got two cruisers and one defender coming in. We've also got the curiosity there. Let's just go and move this to tariff three and just see if we can get it under blockade. Okay. You're escaping. For this, I've uh, sent the Endless Zero into our zone there, look. Okay, research complete with planetary invasion. Invading another planet is a complicated business, requiring well-trained troops, dedicated equipment, and no small amount of good fortune. We should focus our efforts to make as, into making as much of those things as possible. Um, okay, right. So we've got transport module and conscription, and at least the Stellar Marines. So we can actually build transports now. Um... Kinetic weapon enhancement. We could get that. We could also go for serrated musicians, which would allow us to achieve this mission that we've got. And that gives us another 10% kinetic attack. Um, this one comes quicker. I think I'll go for that one quick. Uh, and then we will think about getting the upgraded kinetic. So we're going to get better, better kinetic weapons. Now, I don't remember if we've got a whole lot of kinetic stuff, to be honest. Uh, we really want, we need to go and attack these guys, look, because they're actually sending, they're sending ships at us now. Yeah, we need to go and catch those. Can we catch up with those? No, 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 no. Ah, we went the wrong way. Never mind. Okay, let's just watch this battle. I'm going to just take this uh, this one ship out. Here we go. <laughs> Dramatic stuff. There we go. Look, it explodes have a bit of a look around the battlefield okay yeah we're gonna have to go and catch up with these guys but there's another one here yeah they've they've uh, basically didn't have much in the way of weapons but they've got a little bit of everything with regards to the defenses I'm kind of annoyed that these guys went around the wrong way I should have I clicked on this one thinking they might be able to get there but anyway um, random Thulium event. We've got a trade offer from these guys. They want credits and they're going to give us Ministry of Health and a tech, tech pod. Yeah, let's go with that. I don't mind. Uh, Ministry of Health means we can probably put a leader into the ministry position. Increases growth based on the diligence level of the assigned minister. Okay. Okay, he's pretty diligent. A depressed form assassin, tormented by their guilt. <laughs> we don't have the cash for it though, unfortunately, at the moment. So I'll just have to wait for a little while for that one. Got another event and some Heliosaur. Okay. Surely we should be able to move some of our other ships around. Yeah, let's just see how close we can get to Tariff 3. Tarf 3, sorry. Yeah, we'll send a probe. Yeah, look, he's got a whole bunch of bases, look. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, I really want, we want, oh, I want to be able to destroy these star bases. I just can't. <laughs> I don't seem to be able to do anything about them. Yeah, let's get a star base defense system up here. Okay. And advanced defences. Okay, that's that's given us that, um, you know, 
strong star base that we've that we had so that should stop them from being able to attack us those guys have got the same kind of bases up okay another research mission is complete so we we should have jumped quite far into kinetic weapons these guys might yeah they're going for clark 3 look and they're destroying the uh ships there Yeah, okay, we can't actually reach that. Now, have they got that under... I'm not sure if they've got it under um, Siege yet. This is the most prestigious civilizations. We're not on there, unfortunately. The Kryn are at the top. Um, what have we got here? We've got a Siege ship here. Okay. Now, the Siege... That, we need to keep that Siege ship in a position where it's not going to get killed. Uh, here we've got a Cruiser and a Defender. Okay, these have got a couple of fighters up here. Can we actually reach this? I don't think we can yet, can we? Okay. Let's get these guys down this way to come join this fleet. Um, we'll finish off the... That's just a fighter, isn't it? So what we'll do is we'll send... Let's just have a look at this fighter. Okay. Kinetic weapons and some defences. Let's just see if we can try and kill this just with a couple of ships. Okay, it's got a really, really strong missile attack look. And strong kinetic defense. I think that was just that one ship, though. Yeah, this is the, the fleet report look. Hey, is that right? Harpoon missile? Um... Yeah, this is actually showing the whole fleet, I think, rather than just the ship. Yeah, I kind of wanted to see the one. <laughs> Hang on, lead ship, TAS, Defender 5, ships and fleet 6. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is a, this should say fleet report. Go on, Stardock, get it right. Let's just uh, sort this out. Yeah, uh, we don't need to watch this one, it's just going to be a quick battle. There we go. Dead then. Clark 3. Population's not changing. That's probably a good thing since we haven't got any housing. Yeah, we probably should get some more housing up. Uh, let's get a housing district here. Okay, we've got a probe. I think we move... Send a probe up this way. Yeah, this kind of way. What do we got there? It's a constructor ship for the... Which one of those? That's the uh, Phalanoids. Phalanoids don't like us very much at the moment. Okay, ship coming out on Kindar 2. Uh, we'll get another cruiser, I think. Enhanced railgun lasers and Avenger. Titanium plating. Uh, I wonder if we can get a better design. Let's just go to edit existing design. Looks like we can actually edit this one. No, we can't. Okay. Hang on a minute. Is that allowing us to do it? Yeah, it is. I'm very, very confused by a ship designer. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> okay, so we've got two enhanced rail guns on there. We've got lasers, Avenger, and we've got the kinetic amplifier and titanium plating. Um, we probably want to put a shield on there. So, yeah, we've got 15 on the inventory. Still only saying 4 on the kinetic attack. Um, I think what we'd probably do... That gives it a 12 armor rating. I don't think there's much more we could do here. It looks like the Yor are actually using the... They're actually using... Uh, kinetic attacks anyway. Uh, let's send let's send these out this way, or at least over this direction. Uh, again, uh, this one is the Interstellar Drive Harpoon Missile and Particle Beam. Yeah, let's build one of those. And we've got a siege ship. Um, 
Yeah, sea ship probably wants to. I don't know if like these might actually be up. They might actually just be able to sneak around and attack these now. But I don't think they will. Okay. The reason why I said I think they will is because I'm not really seeing the AI do stuff like that before. Uh, political capital exploration treaty and open borders new. No, I don't want that. Uh, Kindar two. Hang on a minute. Didn't we just do this? Okay, cruiser. Okay. Just want to try and keep an eye on our borders as well. Looks like we've pushed back past um, Garnet 3 there. Our culture's moving out again. Okay, research completing. Kinetic weapon enhancement. A material scientist has devised a new alloy with far greater potential for use in electromagnets. When installed in our kinetic weapon systems, it should lead to a very noticeable increase in other things exploding downrange from our ships. Okay, kinetic attack plus 10% and um, yeah, so we just get plus one kinetic attack. This leads to kinetic weapon targeting, so it's just another another uh, kinetic weapon target, basically. Uh, sorry, another kinetic boost. All right, um, planetary adaption. We've been dodging this one for a while. Uh, we could also upgrade our manufacturing, uh, or we could upgrade our missile payload. Let's go for that. While we're at war, let's just go for the uh, war-based techs. Clark three was destroyed. Okay. And they've flown off this way. Okay, when it says it was destroyed, I think what they meant was they, they destroyed the ships there. Not they actually destroyed the whole thing. Okay, let's get these guys. Yeah, we've got this with this large fleet here. Terran Alliance Clark Fleet 2. Um, let's get those attacking this here. Okay, let's just watch this battle, because this is quite a strong ship. Fall of the All Singularity Fleet 16885. Here we go. Yeah, looks like we didn't even uh, we didn't even uh, take any shots there. Oh no, they did fire. Yeah, they shot at the cruiser and missed, I think. Okay, let's just speed this up a bit. Okay, they're all zooming around for another attack look. Okay, there we go. Uh, so, yeah, ships destroyed one. Yeah, so we just destroyed one of their ships, that means. Okay. Let's get this seed ship in with these guys, so it's escorted, and then we're going to move into uh, Iconia. And what we need to do now is we do actually need to get a transport up. I think I'm going to do that before the cruiser even. Yeah, we can rush build it. And then once we've got the transport out, we should be able to take on Iconia, I think. I think. <laughs> I might need more than that, but we'll see. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything over this side. Where else have the Yor got stuff? Um, it's kind of b back down here towards Tarf. I'm going to keep... I'm going to bring this ship back here. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Yeah, this is saying us moderate casualties, them no casualties. All right. And we've got a Guardian here. All right. Let's see if we can just take it out with just a few of our ships. Let's just try those. Okay, there we go. Let's just try those three. Yeah, again, the TAS Victory 1 look is uh, actually, actually a little bit low on hit points. At least it's so it's saying. Okay, but that was what... Uh, it's actually the weapons that... The, the missile weapons from that ship that actually did the damage. All right.
Okay, no casualties, and we're going to take out these two fighters with the uh, with the, the other three. Battle of Iconia. Uh, so we've got, yeah, these just these two little interceptors. They're probably not going to do much damage. They're actually strong, but like, they're really really strong in the sense that they got a lot of, like decent weapons. Look, yeah, they actually destroyed one of our ships too. Okay, so we lost one of our defenders. We lost a frigate. Yeah, they were. They don't seem to be doing that much damage with uh, with our missiles. These could. These guys could actually win. The other ship coming in. I guess this is the uh, TAS defender. Let's just fast forward to the end of the battle. Oh, we were defeated. Hang on, is that right? Total defeat, yeah. Looks like we lost all three. Okay, that was unlucky, even though it said we were going to win. <laughs> That's bizarre. So, um, yeah, I, get, I, I think what it is is that those ships were just really well defended, look. And, yeah, I'm still surprised at that, but there we go. Okay, so we lost a bunch of ships there. Well, we'll have to come in with our larger fleet and deal with those. Uh, I, it just goes to show that I really don't understand how the combat in this game works anymore. Um... What do they want? Improved armor science for planetary adaption, star-based defense grid, and open borders. No, I don't want open borders with you. Uh, you don't like us very much. And I think that would be a very foolish thing for us to do. Okay. Um, yeah, we're just catching up with these. Now, it's saying total loss and um, no, no casualties. But again, I'm not sure about this. Uh, we'll try it. Um, we might lose this, even though it said no loss on our side. Um, after watching that last battle, I'm not. I'm not so sure. Now we do have a lot bigger, got a lot more hit points. It's just hitting them seems to be the trouble. Okay, I think we got it. Okay, that was a little bit easier. Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, Clark 3 was destroyed. Yeah, I know that. We can just get rid of that now, thank you. Oh, we've got enough culture points to do stuff. Uh, where are the Yaw moving? Yeah, they're just sending, fli uh, they're just sending these little fleets around, uh, these single ships. Uh, we, we just need to focus on uh, Iconia, I think. Okay. Now, uh, we really need a, a trooper. Resolve we want, I think, for that. Guys on. Okay, done. And they need to be, this needs to be sent in with a guard as well, with an escort. Okay, we're going to send these towards Iconia. That same cannot be conquered with the currently selected fleet. That's because they've got a high planetary defense. All right, okay. In that case, we'll go and take one of these smaller ones first, and we'll just we'll take them apart bit by bit. Let's go and attack these guys. Now, this is saying no casualties. Let's just do a quick battle here. Let's just figure it out. Having a think. Hello? Okay, I'm not sure what happened there. Let's go with a quick battle here. Did that work? I guess so. Okay, yep. Um, not. A, I need more feedback in what's going on there. I, th I feel that that's a little bit weird. Let's just see what's over this side of this uh, solar system. Let's get some eyes on that section. Okay, uh, Tarf 3, let's just, yeah, let's just uh, do a quick battle here again. What happened there? Turn Alliance Ico Fleet 1 was destroyed. Okay, we lost a fleet in that one. That one was victorious. Uh, we've got enough culture points to do stuff. Um, okay. Okay. 
Alien Sims will value your trade by 50% more. That's realism. That might be quite good. Ah, plus one diplomacy is always worth getting, so let's go for that one. They're not really acting in a particular... What's the word? In a very benevolent way at the moment. Um, okay. This is Earth. Get another Battle Defender out. We'll just keep pumping these ships out. Okay, we've got another cruiser um, M22. We'll send these ones up this way. Oh, they've got a frigate out here. We should be able to take that thing on. I think. Uh, maybe not. Let's just let's hold back on that. It's a commander ship for a start. 7.92. Yeah, it's got really high kinetic defense. Um now we are ma mainly a kinetic ship, I believe. Yes, we are. So, yeah, I don't think that, that we're not going to win that one. Maybe we bring that back to Earth. I think these are that they're sending that out to Earth to try and attack us. Um, yeah, let's just roll the turn on. Probably want to split our fleet up into smaller into smaller fleets so that we can kind of like uh, pick up on some of these ships that they're sending out. Uh, it's kind of bugging me that I can't take Iconia. I should be able to, like, it was a lot easier to take these in, in Galsiv 3. Now, do we have a seed? I'm sure we got the seed ship here, haven't we? Uh, where are we? Nope. That must have been the other one. Yeah, it was this one here, look. Yeah, see, I, th I, I thought the whole point of the seed ship was that you could put these under, under siege. Um, yeah, I'll figure that out. Okay, De Defender 10. Them, no casualties. Yeah, this is kind of... Yeah, I was going to move this one up this way. I'll bring this one back to Earth. Yeah, the yours, it looks like they're coming to Earth, so let's, uh, let's send this ship back. Try, we'll try and rush build something out from the forge here. Battle Defender might be a good idea because they've got uh, missile missile ships. Okay, we've got ship upgrades available. Uh, the TAS Discovery. I don't think that one's particularly good at combat, is it? No. Um, what should we do with this thing? Let's give it the stealth feel so it can get some evasion on it. Okay. Let's just keep moving this probe over in this direction. To see what we've got over here. Yeah, so I want I want to send the sea ship over to Iconia. It's just a quick battle here. Okay. Did we win? I guess so. Now, can we take this base out? Us extreme casualties, them no casualties. All right, so we've got no hope of damage in these uh, these star bases. They're obviously just way too strong for us at the start of the game. I, I kind of feel this is a bit weird. Like, I don't think that you should be able to upgrade the bases so they're indestructible at the start of the game until you have to, you know, uh, uh, research a whole bunch of stuff. Like, it just seems to be... I don't know. Like it, I guess they kind of want to make it so that the bases just can't be destroyed by like individual fighters and stuff. But that just seemed overkill to me. Like this is a, you know, reasonably substantial fleet. Um, I I feel like that should be able to. Okay, it will take three months to, uh, to conquer this world. All right, there we go. Uh, let's just quick battle here. Our Nikos fleet was victorious. Okay. But it's still there. Stacked ships or fleets 38. Hang on a minute. Is there 38 ships there? That can't be right. I wonder if we've come across a bug here. I'm not sure. Like I think this should be destroyed by now, right? Surely. 
Stacked ships or fleet 38. No, 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 there really are 38 ships here. <laughs> Look at the state of that. Logistics required zero. All right. Yeah, like, I like Galsiv, right? <laughs> but some of it just does not make sense. I don't know if this is just a bug or, you know, whether the game's supposed to be spamming out 38 ships in one hex. I don't know. I don't think you should be able to do that. <laughs> Obviously, they can't, you know, these are just all in one. This is like 38 different fleets. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah, I think I, I think I do think the combat system in this game needs a little bit of work. Because either I'm just not understanding how it works, or the game's just a little bit janky in that respect. Okay, they want kinetic weapon enhancement. Uh, no, I'm not giving you those. And a non-aggression pack, though. Oh, actually, I'd like the non-aggression pack. Uh, let's go and have a look at the diplomacy now. So, and on the diplomacy graph, look. If we go to the humans. Uh, we're at War of Your look. Does it show the non-aggression pact? No, it doesn't show the non-aggression pact. It's kind of interesting. It's ju it just tells you whether you're allied or not. Maybe the non-aggression pact's not really considered to be that useful. In the sense of, you know... It it's not serious enough to be able to show up on that. I wonder if getting an extra two hexes. No, that's not going to do it, is it? That work? No, no. We, just, we didn't manage to quite get to get it in that range. Oh well. Um, let's see what we can do here. Uh, we got an event. Lost cargo. Okay, got some antimatter. And uh, we'll roll the turn on. Okay, let's just quick battle here. This is half three. Okay, fleet was victorious. Looks like there's no animations for when you fire a fight over a um, over a planet so far. Your singularity has ended its war with pirates. Okay, I'm just going to close some of these. Survey started. Oh right, okay, so it's just telling us there's a survey going on up there. Okay, research. Our scientists have special insight into these technologies. Um, yeah, let's just make our weapons better, our missile weapons better. Because our, our weapons absolutely suck at the moment. Yeah, look at this. I've got 30, 38 of these damn things. Okay, it's just quick battle. Yeah, I can you just keep keep building these uh, be building these things. Saying it's still saying it's taking three months to conquer. Fleet insufficient to uh, overcome the planet defenses. Add more transports. Oh god! So we're gonna need ten of these. Ah, we have a crash. <laughs> Folks, I'm gonna end the episode here. Yeah, Gal Gal's still starting to annoy me now. <laughs> uh, I will get this sorted out, and I'll catch you in the next episode. <laughs> Take it easy. Ha, 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 ha.